babes, welcome back to the trash channel. You know what we do, you know what you're here for. Let's roll up our sleeves, fist some asses, and find some good, ethical, sustainable stores. None of this fast fashion bullshit. If you've seen my videos like this before, I did alternatives to Jeffree Star, I did. I tend to do alternatives to problematic brands, and these literally take me like a week to edit, so just, just, thumbs up the video even if you hate me so this video series is going to be a two part i was going to do three but i've ended up being able to squish it all compacted into two videos of alternative ethical and sustainable brands i wanted to get these up in time for christmas so guys myself included let's shop ethically this christmas let's help a small brand Let's help small small artists, small designers, let's help them grow and help them have a better Christmas. I have tried to get so many different types of alternativeness that if they're not in this video, they might be in the next one, so do stick around. If a brand you like isn't featured in this series, don't worry, it doesn't necessarily mean they are not ethical or sustainable. Just pop them a message and ask. But um, I will say a lot of brands will put it in their about me section because it's something you want customers to know. You want customers to know that you care. Let's get it started. Let's get it started. Yeah. I am gonna say right now at the beginning of this video that some of these are quite pricey. Some of them are very, very, very cheap, and some of them are quite pricey. So I don't want you. Oh, they're too expensive. If you want your shops to be ethical, sustainable, you want your workers to be paid a fair wage for what the work that they do, and you want them in healthy, safe work conditions, as I'm sure you would like to work, then I'm afraid that does cost a little bit more. But the other side of that is it will last you a heck of a lot longer. Okay, so I've got my laptop, i got all my notes on here. Zoom in! Oh my god, where's the zoom? I will go crazy. So as always with these videos, I am not, not recommending these brands. I am just telling you they are there. Please, Please, from the bottom of my heart and farts, please, please check reviews before buying at any of these. So we're gonna start off with a makeup one. There is not a lot of makeup in this, in this, there's a hair on my face. Oh, it's just my moustache, that's okay. Uh, there is not a lot of makeup in these series. If you're looking for alternative makeup, I suggest checking out my alternatives to Jeffree Star. I will link that at the end. That is just full of makeup. VE Cosmetics. They are 100% cruelty-free, vegan, and absolutely zero palm oil. They have palettes and lipsticks in the most wonderful weird shades ever. They have a gray palette that is a rival for Jeffree Star's cremated palette, and theirs came out first. They have just brought out a limited edition palette with Cradle of Filth. Fun fact, Danny Filth lives down the road from me. They have a Vixen palette with a fox on the front. A percentage of every sale from the Vixen palette goes to a charity against fox hunting. Shove that up your ass, Boris Johnson. Neon Underground. We're going deeper underground. A small family run business from Texas, y'all. All packaging is eco-friendly. All clothing is handmade to order and sustainable. In clothing size, extra small to 2XL and some tops up to 3XL. They always have and always will be culturally inclusive. They actually sent me a really cute little video um, all about their morals and how much they care about that everybody is included. You could just see how much they cared in their little video. I would put it in but it, the, I've got to keep this nice and short. Um, and they ship worldwide too. Lucian Yak! Yak always reminds me of Ace Ventura. Yak! Lucy and Yak are an ethical brand. They pay all their staff a living and fair wage. They have very specific petite and plus size ranges in sizes XXS to XXL. Leg lengths, leg lengths, leg, I can't say that. Leg lengths, regular and long and worldwide shipping. House of Bats. House of Bats is an eco-friendly vegan alternative jewelry company. Their jewelry is made from 100% recycled acrylic. All their packaging is recycled too. With chokers, necklaces and earrings, they support the Sophie charity. They are very, very reasonably priced too. I've had a few of their pieces and they are so well made. They are based in the UK and they ship worldwide. Bad luck machine. Oh my God, that's like me. <laughs> very small, sustainable, up 
upcycling, slow fashion brand based in Scotland. This video is going to be full of my really shit accents, isn't it? Genderless apparel made for everyone. Hand curated, one of a kind fashion. One of a kind, yo. They currently only ship in the UK. They are very, very small, so give them time, you know, give them time. Brand X Intimate. I love this store. Very empowering fetishy underwear or outerwear if you're brave enough. Ethically made and cruelty free. Based in Leicestershire, the place of cheese in the UK. With worldwide shipping in pieces in size small to medium to 4 to 5XL. They have a sister brand launching soon called Jojo Collective, which is eco-friendly underwear. I also messaged a lot of brands for this video to find out information and this one in particular was so so kind. They they even gave me a 15% off code to, to just give you. So that is really nice and that's the code. Snag tights. They make everything as sustainable as possible and their tights are vegan friendly. So you can chomp away on those bad boys and no animals get hurt. No plastics in their packaging and they are currently working on the world's first biodegradable tights. Sizes UK 4 to 36. That's what I'm talking about. And worldwide shipping. That's literally everyone included. Dipstick store. Wasn't there a Teletubby called Dipstick? Dipsy, Dipstick, Poo, Tanky Wanky. Pastel Kawaii. Did I say it right? Heaven. <laughs> Made in London, everybody who works for this brand is paid fully and fairly. They limit their plastic use as much as possible by shipping in cardboard boxes. Living in a cardboard box. And then you can use the boxes for moving house and putting your pets in and hiding dead bodies or biodegradable mail bags biodegradable tape and confetti size small to extra large with worldwide shipping cat's little factory now i have some ears from cat's little factory that whenever i wear in a video i can guarantee half the comments are going to be where do you ears from they are freaking beautiful and the quality is chef's kiss. Designed and handcrafted by one woman in West Yorkshire, they sell very high quality gloss PVC pieces and I can promise you this good shit. Nipple covers, masks, headdresses. This whole shop just makes me want to go to a fetish club wearing just nipple pasties and pants. Inner circle. Ruby Rose can touch my inner circle anytime. This brand is occult streetwear. They're an independent based brand from the UK. The majority of their items come in small to 4XL. All manufactured in the UK in safe, clean environments with high safety checks. They have a very street, casual, goth vibes and I really, actually really like this store. I'm gonna pronounce this wrong, not on purpose. I, I am May Designs, sorry, Amy? I, I, I am I. I don't know, sorry guys. Belgian based handcrafted, darkly elegant jewelry. They do very beautifully handmade jewelry. Nose chains, I always see people looking for the nose chains where you got high nostril piercings or just normal nose piercings and the chain. They sell the chains guys. They welcome custom orders, they ship worldwide and they do free shipping in Europe. Glitter romance. This is sexy club wear heaven. Peter approved vegan. They have an awesome Harlequin club range. Think of of it as comic Harley going to Ibiza for a week to get over Joker's shit. She's had enough. She's going to Ibiza for a girl's week. This is what she'd be wearing. Clothing in size 4 to 18. Any materials left over from orders is then made into accessories, meaning minimal waste, and they ship worldwide. Elven Forest Creations. Handmade sustainable clothing shop. Custom made orders so they can adjust the length, the fit of anything and everything. Very it's dangerous to go alone, take this. Like Link is gonna jump out from behind a tree and take your hand and just lead you down a path. I mean, I'm, I'm not against that happening. If Link happens to be a tall, slim, goth boy with piercings and tattoos. I mean, I'd quite welcome that, to be honest. Eco-friendly packaging, worldwide shipping, and they even do fantasy wedding dresses. This one I'm definitely gonna pronounce wrong, and I do apologize. Seraphim and Nahima. Oh, I'm so sorry. Little lingerie and nightwear boutique for the darkly inclined. Proudly POC and LGBTQIA owned with sizes from small to 5XL. All pieces are made to order, either custom designed or altered and then manufactured in small amounts. And they ship worldwide. Lifer shop. This Kansas based store, I can't do a Kansas accent because I don't know what I talk like, is patchwork heaven. Now I'm a fan of patchwork. Each piece is a one of a kind, one of a kind, never duplicate 
laminated and can be made in any size any size you wish. They are on the pricier side. I don't know if that's just because I'm a cheap ass hoe, but they are one of a kind. Like nobody else in the world will have that piece of clothing. They use thrifted and secondhand fabrics, shirts and clothing scraps to minimize waste. You can also send in your own pieces of clothing, your own t-shirts to be made into an item and they ship worldwide. Tinkercast! This is cosplay heaven. Fantasy based amazing store from Germany. 100% handmade mermaid ears, mermaid tights, dragon horns, dragon ears, dragon uh, Honestly, so freaking amazing. Octopus tights. Oh my god, this girl loves octopi. They make the most unique tights and pe they just make unique shit, okay? 3D octopus tights. You can look like you've got an octopus because they're coming at you Athletic, fair, vegan, and sustainable, eco-friendly trainers. They won the Fair Trade Award in 2016. Shoes in European sizes 36 to 42. They have a little tip the maker button on each item. I thought this was adorable. So you can see who is gonna make your shoes and you can choose to tip them if you want. I really, really like that. And they ship to the EU, Switzerland, and the USA. Creepy Co. Based in Chicago, this creepy Halloween brand sells officially licensed products and supports independent artists. We like that. They sell awesome pins, stickers, and clothing. They have a new Goosebumps collection, which I just want to wipe my vagina all over. Takes me back to my childhood. Okay, those two things together do not sound right. The clothing range of Goosebumps is so cool. And they do ship internationally. Oh, stretch my little hobbit legs out. Church of Sanctus. Dark luxury fashion. This is very Kat Von D. Don't let that put you off. <laughs> Ethical slow fashion inspired by ritual and the divine. God, cheek bar just got just caught on the back of my tufts there. Made in London in sizes XX to 2XL and free worldwide shipping. Very black and red. Very Lydia Beetlejuice, but very, very Kat Von D. Techno dolly clothing. Very fantasy druid, natural looking clothing. All made to order and built to last. Creating less impact on the environment, yo. All sizes from petite to plus, I feel that I'm 4'11". Even petite length clothes are still too long for me. And you can send them your measurements and get things specifically made to fit you. I got very Lord of the Rings theme from this store. Well, I am 4'11 and I do have hairy toes, so. I could be a hobbit! My friend Andrea is like jumping in her seat right now. <laughs> Devil's remains. The sexiest chokers ever. I'm a choker girl. That is not an invitation to walk up to me in the street and strangle me. These are some sexy boys. Handmade chains and vegan leathers. 15% of monthly profits gets donated to human, animal, and world organizations. These are some badass mofo spikes. Like, you don't want to fuck with anybody with these. These are the type of spikes that would get taken off you at a gig. That's where you know that they're bad boys. Manku shop. Can I just point out that the owner of this shop is so freaking beautiful. So gorgeous. All items are made in store by this one beautiful lady. Very psycho Billy, gothic horror. I love this store. Very Morticia Adams if she decided to just lounge about in sweats for a day. Clothing in size extra small to 2XL with some crop hoodies up to 5XL. Kickwear, rave EBM streetwear, designed in LA and shipped worldwide. In waist size 28 inches to 44 in most of their trousers and tops in size XS to XL. I I cannot tell you how many memories this store brought back to me. I saw their flared jeans and instantly reverted back to my teenage corn limp biscuit slipknot days when I was going out with the skater boy and I was hanging around the skate park when he'd bunk off school to smoke weed behind the bike shed. <laughs> Oh, what fun times I had. <laughs> Moon Maiden. I feel like I need to shout that. Moon Maiden! Based in the UK, they sell an exclusive range of gothic, Wiccan, Renaissance, and steampunk clothing. Everything is hand designed and handmade in sizes, get this, UK 4 to 28 to 30. That is what I'm talking about. They offer worldwide shipping. They even have a cosplay section on their website. It made my tits vibrate. They have a Lydia from Beetlejuice cosplay dress. I just need it. I just need it to go to the co-op. The Grand High Vitch. Hocus Pocus cosplay and more. Sapphic Oracle. Sounds saucy, doesn't it? 
eco-friendly witchy apparel printed on earth positive organic cotton tees God, that was a mouthful and using renewable green energy from wind and solar power that's pretty cool in sizes small to XL. Vrolic clothing. Based in Madrid, Spain. That's my Spanish accent apparently. Like Mateo from Ben and Tom. <laughs> <laughs> all handmade to order. They have some beautiful pieces, like somebody get me the skirt with the spikes around the waist. I want that for Christmas. In sizes extra, extra small to 3XL, and they do custom sizes as well. And worldwide shipping. Kawaii! Did I get it that time? Goods. <laughs> Selling pastel cute kawaii. <laughs> I just want to say kawaii, but every time I say that, you guys jump down my throat. Oh my god, you said it wrong. I am basic, okay? I can barely speak English. J Fashion bags, accessories, and clothing in sizes small to 5XL. Based in California in the US and with worldwide shipping, most items are handmade to order. Here's one that I talk about a lot on my channel. This is Mary Wyatt of London, and I just happen to be wearing a Mary Wyatt top. Kawinky dink. Kawanky wonk. <laughs> Mary Wyatt is one of my personal favourite alternative slow fashion ethical brands. Consciously produced fashion for the dark of heart. Designed and made in London. Female owned and operated in sizes extra small to 2XL. They ship worldwide and I can personally vouch for the quality. I've got quite a few pieces from them. I've worn them so much they are not going see through. They are quality. The print is still printed. They are really good. Vicious Punks. Handmade jewellery from the UK. All components sourced from independent UK suppliers or packaging from recycled material. Every item is made to order ensuring minimal waste. They also have a small amount of clothing and homeware. This is very cutey, punky, teenage I'd say. Very e-girl. I'm gonna pronounce this wrong. Agashi by Cristino. <laughs> I'm sorry. I freaking love your stuff. I'm sorry. Gothic Halloween vintage goodness. This brand gets ripped off so much by these cheap Asian websites. So if you ever see any of these pictures on those sites, this is the original. One woman run and all made to order. Upcycled and size inclusive and shipped worldwide. Support originals, guys. Love pain and stitches for my bitches. Can we just take a minute to appreciate these amazingly spooky bags? Bing! Creepy cute handcrafted bags made by mum and son duo. Pins, wallets, stickers, pumpkin faces, creature from the black lagoon, Frankenstein bags, they do so much that I want. I'm not really a bad girl though, not really a bad girl, but I, I want them. I just want a shelf of pumpkin bags. It could be like Return to Oz. Instead of having a hallway of heads, I'll have a hallway of pumpkin bags. <laughs> Cosmic Drifters, independent witchy boho hippie printed clothing, all original designs and handmade to order in the UK. Sizes UK 4 to 22 in lengths petite, standard, tall and extra tall and worldwide shipping. They have some really lovely print designs as well. They've got one with bugs all over it and one with planchettes and witty hands and they've just got some really gorgeous fabrics. No life till leather. Based in Scotland, custom upcycle faux leather band jackets. One of a kind lace up band tops. Worldwide shipping. They currently only go from sizes eight to 14, but they are hoping to expand soon. Pins and needles, girl. Pins and needles. Sorry, I'm just gonna wiggle my leg while I do this one because I've got pins and needles. Is that my leg? Bed bunny shot. Artist made from start to finish. Made to order original art. Someone get me that dinosaur bra. I need T-Rex titties. Sizes extra small to 2XL and bras in size 30AA to 40L and custom sizing at no extra cost. Hell on shirts, legs still going. <laughs> I'm just excited about Hell on shirts. <laughs> so Hell on shirts is a fucking sick brand. They are labeled as shirts for the sick and this is a must for horror or film fans. They print their shirts in lots. So they have a set amount of each shirt and they do do this priest and they do a release of it and then when it's gone it's gone they don't get it back and I really like this because it makes them more exciting they are UK based and ship worldwide and their clothing comes in sizes small to 5XL KS Garner female owned and handmade to order ethically made in Phoenix Arizona I was watching an unsolved mysteries in Phoenix Arizona last night does anyone else watch unsolved mysteries and then at the end when they're like and it was never solved and you're just like <gasps> what they never solved that? But you're literally watching Unsolved Mysteries. 
sorry, ethically made in Phoenix, Arizona, in sizes extra extra small to 4XL with custom sizing available. The designs are intended to promote body positivity and confidence. Love that. Bones Cult. Independent custom jewellery and clothing run by a husband and wife based in Leeds in the UK. Fuck working with my husband, I'd end up strangling him. They have a vibrator necklace. This calls me. This call, This has my name written on it. They offer worldwide shipping. They also have a section on their site with mental health charities, which I thought was a lovely thing to have because mental health is something very close to my heart and unfortunately my head and it's just I think ha just having that on a website it, it it helps break down the stigma of mental health and I applaud you for that. Wild Mode. Based in Scotland, YouTuber Heavy Metal Mama has done a few videos with them and their quality looks really really good. Vegan, mind and soul positive. Gender free, slow fashion. Ethical fabric, sustainable material. Fair trade in sizes XXS to 6 XL and they ship worldwide and they look comfy as fuck. They do a cobweb range that I just want to lounge around my house and watch Sister Sister in. Ouija Cosmetics. 100% vegan and cruelty free. They have four liquid lipsticks. Is that four? That is four. Four liquid lipsticks in spooky Halloween colours at a good price. They have a good selection of loose pigment shadows and glitters too. Discount Cemetery, casual horror retro brand, 100% printed in LA. Gender neutral, high quality clothing, eco-friendly, 100% cotton tees. Sizes small to 5XL and worldwide shipping. And last but not least, Kagool, which is word for a coat, isn't it? Kagool. Cool. Sewn in London, all made to order alternative vegan clothing. Inspired by the chaotic, strange and surreal, just like me, they ship worldwide and have clothing in sizes UK 4 to 18. So that is it for part one, boobies and hoobies. I hope you enjoyed this. I will put all the shops and their websites in the description below. Check them out. Please check reviews before buying from any of these. I don't want to be held responsible. Hey. You told me this shot was good, I bought it and I got ripped off. Alright, I also told you to check the reviews, you wet lettuce. I will see you very soon with part two. I would love to know if you have any experience with any of these stores. The most ethical way to shop is to thrift, charity shop, DIY. Let's, that's how Alternative started, it was all DIY and making your own clothes and you know, let's get back to that. Do you have an ethical, sustainable store? Do you know any? It could be in part two, but just in case, comment it down below, comment your own stores. Let's spread the small, alternative, ethical, so let's share the people who care. That's it, boobs. Much love, take care of yourself, and most of all, stay weird. <laughs>